Hello everyone. My name is Dr. Aditya Gupta. I am currently pursuing my DM in pediatric oncology and uh, from Ames, New Delhi. And uh, I am a 2012 bad Ames Union and I did my MD in pediatrics again from Ames, New Delhi. So uh, in this video, I'm going to be talking about stethoscopes and instruments you need to have as a medical student. So uh, the only thing that I wanted to emphasize upon is uh, eh, it's something which we all know. Litman, yay! But I wanted to emphasize that Litman is costly. Litman will cost you around 7,000 to 10,000 rupees, depending on the brand, depending on where you buy it from, depending on the kind of discount that you end up getting. Having said that, is it really necessary for a first year medical student to buy a Litman? No, absolutely not. In my opinion, and this is a very good analogy that one of my seniors gave me. When you badminton first, for those who have played badminton, you get directly the best of the best 10,000 rupees ka racket. Lete ho? You always buy that uh, simple 700 Yonex ka racket or silver ka racket for that matter of fact. And when you get better at badminton, then you take a better racket. So initially when you are acquiring the skill, it's actually the more important should be paid on acquiring the skill rather than the instrument. Instrument is just a tool. So I'll actually recommend because the problem with Litman is that it will get lost. Sooner or later, kisi na kisi ka khoega and you will regret uh you know losing that seven thousand eight thousand really good piece of equipment that you have so i'll say stick with microtome microtome is known i think there are other brands as well there is revival there is uh you know midline and things like that microtome is a decent brand quality achhi hai in fact for that matter of fact so buy a good 700 800 rupees ka microtome and keep it built till your pre-final year in your final year and in your internship you can consider buying your little so this is the advice I wanted to give because in the first year, there will be no first year litman in the first year. You are not going to Kleenex. Second year, maybe second half, se mostly Kleenex start. Hote so usme bhi, in the first phase, you will just be learning to know the heart sounds, the respiratory sounds and everything like that. So it's better to stick to a, acquire that skill, you know, play with, initially play with normal Yonex ka, 1000 rupees ka racket. And when you have finally acquired the skill, when you think you are a pro, when you think you are a Saina, Saina Nehwal or, uh, you know, PVS Sindhu, then buy the 10,000, 20,000, you know, uh, Litman. Which Litman? I'll suggest uh, stick to Classic 3. There is a Pediatric Litman, there is Classic 2, there is Cardiology Litman. So unless you are dead set on becoming a cardiologist, there's no point of buying the Cardiology Litman. Stick to Classic 3. Why? Because it has a, both a Pediatric uh, Diaphragm and at the same point of time, it has a Adult Diaphragm. So, it, uh, and it costs almost as same as Classic S2. So, you'll stick, you'll get both the things, best of both worlds. And you will go. There's a link in the description where you can buy, uh, you know, Litman form, uh, and or Microtom form if you are going into first year or you know second year. Next thing that I wanted to emphasize upon, there will be multiple small small things that you need to carry. You know, you know, your torch, your uh, uh, inch tape, and things like that. But hammer, I wanted to emphasize on. A lot of people will carry that, uh, you know, a triangular hammer. So I'll be very blunt. Triangular hammer say reflexes elicit karna bahut mushkil hota hai. So don't go for them and the other thing that people tend to forget is the tuning fork so hammer and tuning fork are really important so i have given a link in the description which i found is so that round circular hammer is the one which is going to fit your bill uh don't go for the triangular hammer please it will be a waste of time uh use a tuning fork uh of all the frequencies 256 512 and 128 hertz and uh, again the link in uh, in the description where you can buy them easily, uh, easily from amazon the one extra thing that i can suggest is vernier calipers. Uh, we all have done uh, 11 12. 11 12 with physics experiment vernier calipers. Say. If you are in surgery, interested in surgery, and want to impress your professors, then you can consider vernier calipers. Otherwise, a simple inch tape is good enough. So, this was my uh, recommendation as far as the medical instruments that you should buy as a medical student. Thank you, and have a nice day.